Hey everybody, this is Extreme Travesty, and welcome back to another episode of Mega Man 2. In the last episode, we took out Metal Man and Bubble Man. Also, pretty quickly, for difficult, this is kind of easy. And in this episode, we're taking on Woodman and Heat Man. Now, in my runs recently, I've been trying to start with Woodman, but in this one, to make it more difficult, I'm going Heat Man. Because there is something in Heat Man stage that is very, very difficult. Again, with the great music, I swear. Just plow right through these guys. Oh, look. They still take one hit, obviously. Why not? Don't want to touch the lava, so. This is where platforming comes into pl play. Ugh. Words, they hurt. Let's see if I can get this guy to despawn. Yay, I got him to despawn. Alright. Saves myself some trouble. And it's our favorite part. Block puzzles. Oh, hello. I think I should be listening more to the TV than my headphones right now because I'm getting a little distracted by the sound of my headphones. I usually only wear my headphones for recording to make sure that my uh, capture card doesn't static out. Which it has done before during my recordings. It, I think it did in one of my Spyro episodes. It also did it in my Super Sluggers episode that I had to skip ahead. But of course, ah, damn it! This one's a little harder to time, but it's still not too bad because you don't have to die. That one you could die on, but you only need one jump. And now for the most difficult puzzle in this level: you get one, two, three, up. Get down here. Wow, I can't believe. Okay, yeah. I can't believe I made that first one, but I knew I would time that other one wrong. Now, the way that. The w old way that I would do it was. Which I'm probably gonna do in my speedrun now, is I do Woodman first, then I go to Airman, and get an item there that would actually help me skip this entire puzzle. But, I wanted to make this difficult on myself and see if I could still remember the puzzle. And don't worry about that life down there, that is just death waiting for you. Okay. Hey, I got it! Sweet! I'd say that's a, I, I would say that's first try, but then again, I did fall, so that was only, that was second try, though. Second try without falling. And I took a hit for some reason. I didn't have to take that hit. But, here we are at the other Dr. Wily door. Now, how do you take out the heat? Get the bubbles out. And Heat Man, you're going down. Ow. After you hit me first. And again. It's pretty simple. Just watch out for him when he transports and just keep firing the bubble light at him. And he's down. This is like the best I've ever done in difficult. Because I've played on difficult before and I couldn't even get past a couple of the bots because I think back then I didn't know the order for like weaknesses. But playing this game a lot more often now, the weaknesses are just right there. It's like, okay, I can do a whole lot better. And Dr. Light got another message for us. So now with the order, I think difficult setting is a whole lot easier. Especially when you've played this game enough times on normal mode to know where everything is. So now we get item number one. Seems a little out of order, but these are the ones you gotta beat to get these items. And now we go to Woodman. And he looks pretty sinister and defensive, doesn't he? Well, that's his whole point. Oh, shit. Okay, they take a... Of course they take more hits. Why not? And I'm gonna make that, bun that rabbit respawn, too, aren't I? Yep. Alright, let's 
let's get rid of these guys. Well, you know what? Pull out the metal. <laughs> wow. Cool. I got a health pickup and I still dodged that carrot attack. Alright, come on. I knew there was another one. And he gave me a, a power pickup. There. Did that, did. I don't trust these guys. Wow, they're giving me all the pickups now. Fire breathing dog! Ah! I knew I would take at least <laughs> one hit there. Whoa. Ah! I hit the ceiling. Okay. I clipped through the wall. Ah! You know what? Just, just take his metal blades to the face. Alright. I only got two more of these things. They're invincible when curled up, but once they open up, then they're pretty much open for attack. The only time they close back up is when you get hit. Oops. Kinda wasted the first few of those shots. Oh god, burns! Yeah, good idea. Take those eggs out before they hit the ground. Oh, thanks for the free life. I like that. That's the other thing. I like that the random drops. Wow, there was, I thought there would be another monkey. Oh well. Alright. These hairs aren't really that... I could have made a pun. I really could. I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure anybody who watches my videos will make puns. Go for it. Alright. Well, these guys I'm just gonna jump over because I'm annoyed by them. They're pretty much... Okay, I keep forgetting I can't jump over that one. For some reason. Now, I'm going to get out my heat. And if I'm not mistaken, I think it takes... Well, in normal mode, this usually only takes one hit. Oh, I'm not charging. There we go. Okay, let's charge it. Full charge. Yep, it takes more than one hit. Okay. That's okay. Takes two hits. And that's it. Woodman is down on two Heatman full blasts. It's nice to know that when you know the order. And now we get the leaf shield. Which is pretty much what it is. A leaf shield. So, back to the stage select screen. We have two robots left. And that will do it for this episode. We have taken down Heatman and Woodman. Thank you all for watching. In the next episode, we take on the final two master robots. Then, we go after Dr. Wily. See you guys next time.